My name is John Alofs, and I'm founder CEO of Eyewear by ROI based here in Phoenix, Arizona and a 1981 graduate. I nominated Patty Thomas class of 79 with a ophthalmic dispensing degree. I didn't know Patty back at ECC. Patty and I met about 20 years ago when I made a sales call at Northeast Eye Institute in Scranton, Pennsylvania. Many times in our industry you will come across people that are ECC graduates and it's always a big smile, it's always a question of what year you graduated, who were your uh, instructors, who were your professors, and there's a kinship in the eye care industry with ECC grads. Over the years we've gotten to be good friends and our business meetings consist of one part business and two parts sharing family stories and pictures of our kids. Patty's had an amazing career path. After being the buyer, she was named Director of Optical Operations, a $25 million business. She's a nationally known speaker, a published author, and recently she was voted by Vision Monday, one of the optical trade magazines, as one of the 50 most influential women in the optical industry. When I was here at ECC, I really didn't, didn't know how large the optical industry was. And during my time here, the professors encouraged us to go to the large trade show in New York City. It's the largest trade show in the United States. They encouraged us to go there to see what we were a part of. So several of us got on the train and we went to New York City and we attended the trade show and I had no idea that the optical industry was so huge. And it was so eye-opening for me because there were all these large frame companies and lens companies and contact lens companies. And I realized all the opportunities that were there before me. So it helped me realize that there were lots of places to go. I really could go anywhere. Patty is the ambassador for ECC for each time she speaks at an optical conference she's introduced as an Erie graduate and she has given over 100 seminars throughout the country. Among her accomplishments are she's the past president of the Pennsylvania Opticians Association, member of the Scranton Junior League, and president of the Waverly Community Center. I view community service as an act of responsibility, not merely an act of generosity. I think it's everyone's responsibility to give back to the community where they work and where they live. It is my pleasure to introduce my friend and one of tonight's honorees, Patty Thomas. <laughs>